Man, I feel so bad about this situation, not just as a New York Rangers fan, but as a fan of this player and, of course, hockey overall. So, Philip Heedle is now officially out for the rest of the 23-24 NHL season. This is admittedly a bit of a strange one. So, earlier in November, he suffered a concussion, and he's got a long history of concussions. He's only 24 years old, but he's had at least four already. Anyway, given his serious history, he spent a lot of time recovering. He just recently rejoined the Rangers in New York so he'd get in on some practices. However, while on ice at practice, he suffered some form of setback. We don't exactly know what happened. There were only three players on the ice. They were doing some sort of drill, and he had to be helped off, which, you know, is not great, especially considering his past history. The Rangers posted that the organization's top priority has been Phillips' health, and we will continue to fully support him in his recovery with an aim to return for the 24-25 season, with Hedl himself saying, it has been the hardest three months of my life and has not been been easy for my family, closest people, and of course the organization, but we gotta stay positive even in these tough moments and just think what is ahead of us. Thanks for all the nice messages. I'll come back stronger than ever. I really hope he does. I mean, Heedle has been one of my favorite young Rangers players. He really was an exciting member of that kid line, especially in the 22 run the Rangers went on. And I mean, he's a first round draft pick that's actually been panning out. However, at this point, with four concussions and with some sort of recurring injury now, I do have to wonder about his future playing hockey. Obviously, when it comes to brain health, like, you gotta do what's best. With the injury, however, the Rangers now have an extra about $4.5 million to work with. A couple months ago, I would have said, great stock up for the playoffs. Based on their play the last month, I don't really know what they're going to do. Rumors are they want Sean Monaghan. I hope they stay far, far away from Monaghan. No offense to the player, I just don't really trust him. But I guess we'll see. Anyway, those are my thoughts. Let me know yours down below.